So a few days ago, you guys saw we posted a new video where we went out, we bought a brand new vending machine location, which we still haven't been over there to restock the machine. So today, that's exactly what we're gonna be doing. You guys can see we got a bunch of drinks here with us. We got Gatorade, we got uh, vitamin water, which I've never sold this before. <laughs> Do you think there's gonna be money in the machines? Oh no. Yeah, there's not gonna be money because like I said, they close weekends, today's Monday. There might be like 10, $15 maybe, if we're lucky. I say five. Five dollars? Five. <laughs> Hopefully it's not that bad. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If y'all do, drop a like, subscribe if you haven't already, and let's go restock those machines. Let's, let's go. go. <laughs> Bring me back. Uh, <laughs> this thing's actually pretty heavy. I know. You made me push and pull like 50 times. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. Yeah. Is the car gonna put itself back or what? Who are you talking to like that? No, I was telling myself that. Oh, más te vale. You wanted to park far. I'll just take myself over there. <laughs> the AC better work. Let's see. Ah, oh, yes. That AC feels so good. So every single time we get into the car, we have to cross our fingers that the AC works because it never does and it gets me so mad. Especially when we got to go and restock the machines because, you know, we need the AC for the chocolate. Are you running out of breath? Yeah, I ran over there to put up the cart. It wasn't even that far. Yeah, it was. No, it wasn't. Before we continue, this video was sponsored by NordVPN. NordVPN is a virtual private network that protects and encrypts your information in public either in Starbucks, McDonald's, hotels, airports, anywhere just in case there's that one weird guy in the corner trying to get into your bank account or any other personal information which could be bad because if somebody gets into your bank account and they take your money how else are you going to spend money on vending machines? But not only do they keep your information safe, they also give you access to restricted content in some countries. For example, in China, for some reason, you can't watch YouTube and Netflix. What do people do over there in China? Scroll down and you can pick any of the 60 countries that they offer, for example, the US. You click on it and there you go. You are now in a different country and you can watch pretty much anything you want. You can also connect up to six devices per subscription so you can also protect your whole family without spending more money on more subscriptions. So if you guys want to go check them out, just go to nordvpm.org slash Ibanez or just use coupon code Ibanez and you guys will get 70% off the three year plan. So yeah, again, go check them out and let's get back to the video. Let's go. All right, so we are finally at the brand new location. We have everything in the car. We got the chips and everything. Are you excited? Because you still haven't seen the machines. No, I haven't. I wonder how big they are. But before we go inside, I'm going to show you guys some of the things that we bought because uh, you guys know they don't sell the exact same things I sell. You want to show them what we got? Yeah, let's check it out. So yeah, we got some chips. We have um, Skinny Pop. We got Fig Bars, Crackers. What do we got on that side? Not Almond. So you guys know last time I was supposed to buy some almonds because this machine sells almonds. But of course, the one day we go to Sam's and try to buy almonds, they, they are sold out. So true. Yeah. Every time. They were always there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, look at this. Uh -huh. So <laughs> I gotta sell this for a dollar just because each one is about a dollar. So I gotta make money on it. So we got chips. Healthy nasty chips. And then we got some more healthy stuff. The Skinny Pop, Big Bars. So this time, I am gonna be putting some of the things that I do sell already. For example, cupcakes. Last time I came, they didn't have cupcakes, so this time I will be putting them in the machine. And on this side, we got some more drinks. We got ice, we got Gatorade, we got Diet Dr. Pepper. The previous owner had all the candy bars for a dollar fifty. Like, what? that's a lot of money. That's a lot of money. A dollar fifty for a Snickers or a Hershey or anything is a lot. Because whenever the lady told me how much the location makes every single month, I was like, dang, that's pretty good. And now I know why. Because all the prices are like very high. Also today, I did bring the GoPro. That way uh, we can get a better view of filling up the machine. I always have trouble putting this thing on. I mean, you, you can't even tell, right? Nah. Okay, yeah, there we go. So uh, it should be good now. Say hi. Hi. There we go. We got the GoPro. We got all the stuff in the car. We got the drinks, chips, everything. 
And also we got the brand new dolly. So uh, we got everything ready. Now let's go inside and restock those machines. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, look, I have no idea why I got gloves on, but they're black, they look cool, and yeah, that's the only reason why. We're actually practicing how to tattoo people, so... No! Yes, we are! Alright, so there we go. We are finally back. We have all the drinks on the cart. This is a machine. So it's your first time looking at it. What do you think so far? It looks pretty cool, baby. It's nice, right? It's big. Yeah, it's weird to look at all the things that we normally don't even get. Yeah, like we never, like look, we never sell that. We, ne we don't sell any of this. Canada Dry? I've never even tried that. I think pretty much the only thing we sell is water and Gatorade. And <laughs> everything else we don't. No. Alright, so there's a the key. You want to do the honors? All the way down here? Yeah, it's so low, right? Yeah. Now with this one, it's like a fridge, so you gotta open up the big door. Oh, I thought this was part of it. I was like... So actually, last time I came, they told me if I can put Red Bull in the machine. Um, so I gotta take one of these off. Let me see. Now the question is, is Red Bull going to fit right there? Yeah, because how skinny it is, right? There's only one way to find out, baby. Cross your fingers, because we, we bought this just for the machine. Does it fit? Oh, it actually does, it does fit. Yeah. Yes, it fits. Okay, so that's good. This whole thing doesn't come out? No, it's not a snack machine. Oh. You see what I was talking about? They have weird stuff, like all that. They have, what is this? Oh, those are my favorite things. You know what these are? Yeah. So look, the same with this one, like I said, the prices are kind of high because look, E3, which is the Snickers, look, E3, $1.50. Well, since you said you wanted to do the soda machine, get to it. No? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah, just put as many as it goes back. I think maybe 10. Where's the little thing where you can just leave the, the box of soda on there? You can't. You just gotta... Carry it? Yeah. Also, the thing with this one, we gotta make sure the drinks are facing the front, cause they're you know, gonna know what it is. yeah, they're not gonna they're not gonna know. So, like this one, this one, all oh, those are good. And boom, there we go. So that quick, look look how much of a difference that makes. It when beautiful. Yeah, like it's that. a huge difference when the machine is full and empty. It looks nice. I mean, it would look a lot better if this dumb light worked, you know? Because oh, it looks, totally. yeah, it looks dark right now. But I mean, it still looks good. Um, but yeah, snack machine is full. Soda machine is full. So I did lower some of the prices. For example, the water, last time it was $1.25. That one is now a dollar. All the bottles before, they were $1.50. Now they're $1.25 just because they're 16 ounces. They're not 20 ounces. Yeah. But like I said, they close weekends. I want to check the money to see if there's money inside, but I, it. I haven't checked it. Are you waiting on me? Should we check it? Yes. All right, here we go. Dun, dun, dun. Uh, Is there? Oh, wait. Oh, 
You guys did see that with the soda machine, there was no money inside, only $4. You want to check the, the snack machine? You think there will be something in there? No. <laughs> I mean, let's see. It looks empty. Is there at least something in there? Yeah. I see a dollar in there, or two, or three, or four. A lot more. Yeah, so of course, that did a lot better than the soda machine. Um, again, I'm pretty sure it makes a lot more in credit card sales, which I don't have access to until, yeah, of course. Um, but I mean, it's not bad. Let's see if there's any coins though. Look how skinny this thing is. <laughs> what? It's so cute. Look how skinny it is. <laughs> That's adorable. Let's see. It's so long also. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. It's so skinny and so long. There's a few coins in there. Maybe like 50 cents. So we actually took the goldfish out just so we can put uh, the cupcakes. Because you guys know cupcakes are literally the best seller from all of my locations. That always goes good. I'm surprised she didn't have it in here. But other than that, everything should be good. You ready to go? Oh yeah. My apple juice. Your apple juice? Mm hmm Yes! That looks so satisfying. Got it. I'll be back in a few days. Uh-uh! <laughs> Is it dirty? No, that's not me. Goodbye, machines. Say goodbye. Bye. Goodbye. All right, let's take the cart and let's go. Push it. It's apple juice time. Open wide. What do you think? Is it worth a dollar fifty? No. It's not. No. Okay, so I got you the apple juice. What snack do you want? The what? <laughs> what snack do you it's want? Not from there. Pick a snack. I can't even read what it says. Okay, so look, we got <laughs> me either. So we, we got Hershey's, we got M&M's, regular M&M's. I really can't tell what chips are those. All right, so we are finally back home. I got some good news and some bad news. The good news is that we finally got the credit card machines for the new location, so there we go. We also got these over here. You guys might be wondering, Jaime, what are these? These are basically the coils to fit the ramen noodle cups, um, like the little cup noodle soup. I mean, everyone knows what that is, right? <laughs> Do we have one so I can show them? No. Uh, and we also got this LED kit over here, which is for the snack machine that you guys saw today. So finally, the machine will no longer be dark. Now, for the bad news, of course, I get all this the day that we just leave to restock the machines. Of course. Right? Aw, baby. <laughs> I come home, I see a huge box with everything inside, so now I gotta go back. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I hope you guys did enjoy the video. We didn't collect the money today. Uh, we're not gonna be collecting it until next week. Anyways, hope you guys did enjoy the video. If y'all did, drop a like, subscribe if you haven't already. We got a really cool video coming out soon, so make sure you guys have the notifications turned on. And again, that's all. See you guys next time. Peace out, and I love you guys. Bye. Yeah. Testing. Yeah. Uh, so we are finally back home. I got some good news and some bad news. So the good news is that we finally got the credit <laughs> <laughs> What if I break them? They're expensive. <laughs> Watch out.